I am Vanita, Assistant Professor, Department of Information Technology from Manal Thirmanayako College. In this video, we are going to discuss about computer networks. What is computer networks? Data communication is a process of exchanging data of information. What are the components of data communication? Uh, com components is nothing but what are the needs, uh, needs uh, uh, used to in the data communication. First one is message, sender, receiver, medium and protocol. Uh, message is nothing but text, audio, video and then uh, text, audio, video and then sender means who is sender? Who sent the message? He is the sender. Who is receiver? Who received the message? Sender always send the uh, Send, send the data. Receiver always send the request. And what is medium? Do you have any uh, idea about uh, medium? Medium is nothing but is uh, device. We have so many mediums to use to transfer the data. And what is protocol? What a protocol is nothing but set of rules. And then next we are going to discuss about data flow. What do you mean by flow? Flow is nothing but information from one place to another place without any delay. We have three types, single duplex, half duplex and full duplex. Single duplex means we have sender, receiver. Receiver always send the request. Server always receive the message and request Cut uh, what is single Set, uh, sender? We have two types, sender and receiver. Sender always send the message, receiver always send the request. First of all, sender accept the request and send the message to the receiver. Here, single duplex is a unidirectional. Unidirectional means one way directional, half duplex, full duplex, both are bi-directional. Half duplex means sender and receiver send the data but not at the same time. And full duplex means sender and receiver send the data at, at the same time. Okay. And then types of networks. We all know types of networks, we have three types, LAN, WAN, MAN. Computer network can be defined as a collection of nodes. Within a 1 kilometer, we can transfer the data used by the LAN. Within a 10 kilometer, we can transfer the data used by the MAN. And worldwide, we can change the exchange the data used by the wide area network. This is the three types of networks. And then physical topology. What is physical topology? Physical topology is nothing but just a device. We are using device between the physical layer, one layer to another layer using mesh topology, star topology, bus topology, ring topology. Mesh topology nothing but this is mesh topology. More than one devices connected each other. Okay. And then next one is the star topology. Star topology is nothing but the center topology. It is the server, receiver, this is receiver. So, receiver send a request to server. Server accept the request and send the message to the receiver. So, we have more than receiver using the same server in the star topology. Bus topology is nothing but end to end topology. Ring topology is nothing but one end topology, one topology connected to another one. This is the ring topology. And finally, we are going to discuss about OSA layer. OSA layer means open system interconnection layer. We have seven layers. What are the layers? Physical layer, data link layer, network layer, topology layer, session layer, presentation layer, application layer. Next, in the next, from upcoming video, we are discuss about Detail of OSA layer. Thank you.